When I first started Red Gum, one of the very first events we did, I cooked a hog, and I'm talking like back in 2013. But I really started kind of getting really introduced into cooking a whole hog when I spent time in Georgia and met a bunch of different pit masters over there. Pigs are a really wonderful way to kind of feed people on mass. For me, it's like the most traditional form of barbecue there is. This concept of a barbecue pit is pretty much about digging a big hole in the ground, filling it with coals, putting some sort of grate or mesh over the top, and then they'd cook hogs. So I've made three custom pig cookers. I just feel like somehow welding and building cookers goes hand in hand with being a pit master. So this year's meat stock, we are doing a whole hog barbecue. The other thing we're doing is a whole beef four quarter, basically the front end of a cow. All that stuff that's perfect for low and slow, so. But also we're doing half birds in Alabama white sauce, so it's gonna be great. We're getting our beef through Flinders & Co, which is another business that has really strong ethics around you know, sustainability, supplying grass-fed products, free-range products. So they're supplying us with their Roaring Forties grass-fed beef. It was, it was really important to us that, obviously, we went to a meat stock with a really unique, cool offering to the people that love barbecue. I think we're rocking up with five whole hogs, and then we've got at least five four quarters, but depending on size, it might be more. We'll have something like 600 half birds, half chickens, like there's a lot, there's a lot of food, there's a lot of meat going on. <laughs>